Good morning, guys. Um, today is the 26th, also known as Boxing Day. But in America, it's just the 26th. And uh, yeah, today's Matt's last day, so we're going to let him pick where we're going to eat for breakfast. Um, it's going to be a surprise. I don't know where he chose, but he's going to walk us there. And then... We're going to go to the Field Museum. And then hopefully the night market. So a lot of stuff to do today. Let's hope it's fun. Jenny said, I love how the couch is so big. I never have to ask for a refund. It's huge. Dunkin' Donuts is better than that. Cause you gave you gave something Dunkin' a seven and a half. Fine, I'll give this an eight. <laughs> this is tomatillo scrambled. It's really good. I'll give it like an eight and a half. I got the same as Matt. Uh, the tomato tillo what? The tomato tillo scrambled. Uh, I give it a seven and a half. It was spicy. I didn't realize that. But uh, it's good. It looks too green, like too healthy. You know what else is big, Matt? We are here at the museum. He's big. I tried to speak Spanish to him, but then he spoke back to me and I just said, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> First exhibit we're at is the African exhibit. How many languages do Africans speak? Fifteen. Fifty-seven. How many do you think? Thirty. Eight hundred. Eight hundred. Oh my god. <laughs> I was close, I win. How much of Africa is jungle? 70%. I'll say 90%. I'll say 77%. Not a bit. There are no jungles in Africa. <laughs> so bad. Did you even read the answer? It's 15. Nearly 15. No, but in 1993. How much of Africa is dry grassland? I'm going to say none because they tricked me before. 50%? I'll say 60. 40. 40. I was wrong. <laughs> right, make some mind, Matt. Around the world, bottom floor, <laughs> using process. This is the sound Jenny makes when she's yeah. grouchy or relaxed. Ready? <laughs> Jenny makes that when she's angry. Jenny, is it true that when you're angry you make this sound? <laughs> yes. Itself. Act it out. <laughs> so many exhibits. My goodness. We are being selective now and we are going to see dinosaurs. The dinosaurs and evolving planet. Can you do LOVE with your one hand? Huh? Go. I don't, I don't associate with that word. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, mom. <laughs> Found a small dog. You can't hear that. Found a small dog. It's like I'm buying it for my daughter. <laughs> like, I got the penny. I got the penny too. Wait to do it. Go Merry ahead, Christmas, Jenny. It's my Aww, Christmas. Slowly. Thank you. you have to push it in, babe. Oh. No, you meant to pick what you want first and then put the money in. Oh, fucking hell, man. So we did, so we did you even get one? Yeah, we did. It's a surprise. There we go. There we go. We got something. What'd you make? T-Rex. That's, that's a good one. Yeah. 
Thank Merry, you. Merry Christmas. Thank you, Matt. I spent 50 That's cents it. on her for Christmas. I'm a baller. <laughs> so generous. Why is it bent? Because that you engraved it. I'm a great photographer. What have you learned? I've learned a lot. Like, so much. Something I remember is the largest sand dune in the Sahara is the size of... France. Correct. <laughs> she didn't remember, I just reminded her. Museum done. It was pretty, pretty, pretty exhausting, it but it was really good, very, very good. educational. Yes. I feel like my IQ has risen by 20 points. <laughs> um, but yeah, we're gonna try find something to eat now. Um, first, we gotta try and find the exit because this place is huge. And I, and I need a haircut too, so I'm gonna go get a haircut. We could spend all day here. We could have. I don't think my brain could hold all that information. There's no way you can go like see everything here in one day. That's why they have a U membership. Yeah, they'll try to sell us a membership at the start. I was confused, but now I understand. Keep going, keep going. Yeah. <laughs> Let's be more slick. You're cool. It's your boy Matt, aka the photographer. <laughs> you know how old it is, man? Gotta capture these two lovebirds. On their journey through Shy Rock. Yeah, beautiful city. You know, I may as well be a tour guide as well while we're at it. So, yeah, hit me up. <laughs> so, we have decided She's to go hops. to. She's uh, got hops you, Kenny. Hell no. So, we have decided to go to the Burger Bar, which is a place where they make beer shakes and, and I burgers. Think burgers, maybe. I don't know. <laughs> so we'll see if it's good. I got a sleepy dog white ale. Not bad. Not bad than the other one. Oh, okay. The first one we had? I think that was the best one. Okay. The Indian one? Oh no, the one we had with Josh. Oh yeah, that was yeah. good. What's the best thing? Indian ale. Oh. So it's kind of that. I don't know how to describe it. Do you want to try it, Matt? Got a Oreo Blitz. That shit is good. I like that better than the first oh, one. Really? Yeah. That's good. I don't drink. Mm. That's a nice cup. I do not like that at all. A little boy. 10 out of 10. Really? So I got a Smokehouse burger. A surprise. <laughs> I forget what it's called, but. Seems good. The fries are really good too. Vinny's not hungry. Which is the first. <laughs> she just wants to have an empty stomach for all the beers. I'll eat at the Alcohol. market. And they eat my fries. I'll be the judge if it's the best burger in Chicago. What are your thoughts? That's a 9.7. That's really good. Juicy? Yeah. Flavorful? Yeah. All of the above. Mine's pretty big. I don't know how this is gonna fit in my mouth. I don't know, I give mine like a like a six point seven. It's so soggy. Like the one that we had, the burger I had at um the Cheesecake Factory is better. Anyway, this burger place. Disappointment. Didn't even get alcohol in my shake because it was too expensive. And the burger was not the best in Chicago. I'll disagree. The burger was delicious. I loved it. I would highly recommend this place. <laughs> He's just being a sook. He didn't like it because it was soggy, like, it was still good, tasted good. All goes down the same hole whether it's soggy or not. So now we're going to head to the Chris, King, Chris Kringle Night Market, where... I don't know what to expect. Who are we meeting there? Another celebrity, Jamie Hale. <laughs> I might have, they're going to substitute one celebrity for another because I'm going to have to go get a haircut. So <laughs> I'm going to have to step out for a little bit. Hey guys. So we are now at the night market, the Chris Kringle night market. Matt went to go get a haircut and uh, yeah, we're gonna meet up with Jamie and explore. Mm -hmm. It looks pretty small. This is it? I don't think so. 
Well, the market is closed. It actually uh, is after Christmas, so that's why it's closed. And yeah, right now we don't know what to do. Hi guys, we're in TJ Maxx, and we have decided to all get matching toiletry bags. We have three here. One for me, one for Kenny, one for Kenny's mom. And then I got this set of lashes for my sister. This is adorable. Old spice. This is adorable. Only Old Spice is like too generic. Like, it is. Make fun of it. Can you smell that? Can you smell that? Yeah, it smells amazing. Have a whiff. Yeah. Oh, that is high end. <laughs> do you have mouthwash in your toiletry bag? Nah, no, 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 in my essentials. All right, let's do. What's, What's in Jamie's? What's what is in, in my Mr. Essentials. Hale's essentials? What is in your bag, Jamie? Can't go anywhere without my moisturizing curl activator cream. <laughs> Absolute essential. Yes, because you have so many curls in your hair. The other thing I can't go without, just a general purpose, you know. Cocoa if butter. your lips are a bit dry, if your hands are a bit dry, you know, just a Vaseline with the cocoa butter, essential. <laughs> All right. And the final thing, no, no, that's no, not essential. Wet wipes? Band-aid? Wait, wait, wait. Hang on. Anvil? You need, need the disinfectant. Dis 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 probably good for the uh, practice, you know? Oh, what gets you through college basketball is just a few Advils and oh, no, I And the final essential, you know, going through planes, going through all kinds of public places, you know. There's just a lot of germs, you know, and this hand sanitizer really makes sure I'm not getting sick so I can play at my peak and all that kind of thing. Essential. Hey, put your, uh, put your stuff in, Jimmy. I got you, bro. Thank you so much. What a go. Here you go. Should be custardy. Smell? Mm -hmm. Smells like sweet yogurt. This is like melted vanilla ice cream. Does not taste like eggs? Very creamy vanilla ice cream. Melted vanilla ice cream. Would you rate it? Not bad. Three out of ten. What? Oh, that tastes rough. Really? Mm. Oh, that's like a four. A four? Yeah, you want to try some? The afterburn hurts. I said three out of ten. There's a burn? Yeah, it's just like a, it just hits you in the face. Like. It tastes like Christmas. Like it's good at the start. They're probably yeah, good. Stuff. Mm. That's good. Later, it hurts. I like it. I don't like that. One. I like it. Yeah, but you can have it. I don't want a stomach ache. That's going to do that to you? Yeah. I think we're just going to end the night here. So yeah, thank you so much for watching. Bye.